Sean Spicer criticized Democrats for not being cooperative and moving along uh, a sufficient number of nominees to cabinet posts, and I expect that that is going to be a drumbeat we continue to hear as more and more of these cabinet nominees in their uh, confirmation hearings uh, find themselves subject to criticism from Democrats, uh, not so much from Republicans, but in some cases they will, and uh, that is going to create some static and, and make it difficult to uh, fill out this government as quickly as Donald Trump would like. We expect that uh, people like Jim Mattis, the nominee to be Defense Secretary, Mike Pompeo, the CIA Director Choice, are going to be confirmed rapidly, probably tomorrow, uh, as uh, uh, President-elect Trump becomes President Trump. Uh, but uh, Steve Mnuchin is going to face some tough questions at his confirmation hearing today about foreclosures, about ties to Wall Street, all that sort of thing. Uh, and we've had similar questions about uh, Rex Tillerson, his ties to Russia, his ties to the fossil fuel industry. And uh, Rick Perry's on the Hill this morning. Interestingly, Rick Perry has said uh, he regrets having called for the elimination of the Energy Department, uh, said that he does believe that climate change is real and partially caused by human activity. Uh, those are things that would be seen as uh, steps forward by Democrats. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.